Name, image, and likeness endorsement contracts are starting to dominate college athletics. The opportunities can be life-changing. Bethel University became the first Division III school in Minnesota, the second in the country to launch a platform to connect student-athletes to businesses and nonprofits. Norman Seawright explains. I think I always saw it as something for Division I and Division II athletes. So for it to be Division Three, I just didn't realize the opportunities that were available for Division Three athletes, and so it's really exciting. Bethel University graduate volleyball player Hannah Wilhite is one of many student athletes using the newly launched Royal Exchange. It aligns with Bethel's mission, and so organizations can come in and work with athletes to promote their nonprofit, their charity, their ministry. It's an opportunity for us to provide our student athletes another way to, to be excellent. The university is not directly involved. A third party administrator vets everything for NCAA compliance. It's a big help as athletes because I think it's hard to kind of go out on your own and find all these places. Because the Royal Exchange is centralized, it gives student athletes a chance to partner with brands that align with what their values are, whether or not they're being paid. I'm looking into different ministries. Um, that's kind of what gets me excited. As a fifth year, I know some people are all about being paid, um, which is so great. I'm just looking for places that I can help make an impact in. We really, really want our student athletes to have a broad based, holistic college experience. While it's not a recruiting tool, our student athletes, through their social media and their brand, is amplifying the Bethel brand. That was really a thing that put me over the edge, like, wow, this is a no-brainer. Will Height and the other Royals can show off a little school pride. For it to promote the school and athletics and our values is super special. Norman C. Wright, WCCO4 Sports.